Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So in January, I posted letting you know that as of the 4th of January this year, 2024, Google had enabled a feature called tracking protection in 1% of all Chrome browsers. And as mentioned in that video, which will be in the end screen, this is their first phase of, in, of ending support for third-party cookies by the end of this year, 2024, in the Google Chrome web browser. Now, just a quick recap. This tracking protection, as mentioned, was only rolling out to 1% of all Chrome browsers by default. And if you weren't in the 1%, you could always enable the feature using an experimental flag, which you can go check out how to do in that previous video. Now, just to let you know now that it seems now that Google has started working on the second phase of deprecating third-party cookie support in Google Chrome. And they've started enabling the tracking protection settings that will be used for 3PCD, which is short for third-party cookie deprecation, to a hundred percent now obviously this is also hidden behind an experimental flag in the early preview version as an example google chrome canary 125 and hasn't made its way yet to stable or hasn't rolled out by default yet but the fact that the flag is available um, is a good indication now that obviously they are starting to prepare for that 100 percent rollout to deprecate third-party cookies by the end of this year and obviously um Tracking protection limits cross-site tracking, just a quick recap. And um, they are planning to phase out third-party cookies by the second half or the end of this year, 2024, as I have posted previously. Now, if you want to try out tracking protection uh, settings um, that will be used at 100%, in Chrome Canary 125, as always, we have to enable an experimental flag. And as mentioned, not available as yet in the stable, this flag, but if we hit in Chrome Canary to our Omnibox and we enter Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags, and in the search, we just type in tracking. Protection or P. Yeah, we can see the first flag, tracking protection for three PCD, which has enabled the feature if you weren't in the 100, sorry, if you weren't in the 1%. Now we can see that tracking protection settings launch is the next flag. And when this is enabled, it says enables the tracking protection settings that will be used for 3PCD 100% as mentioned. So you change that from default to enabled, relaunch the browser to apply that flag. And now obviously with that flag uh, applied, what this means is that um, by the end of this year, uh, 2024, um, unless obviously there are no regulations put in place um, by um, UK competitions or EU and so on, all Chrome users will see these tracking protection settings and have full control over third-party cookie deprecation and um, the end of third-party cookie support in the browser. So just putting it out there because obviously it means now that with this new flag that's become available uh, in Chrome Canary, um, this is a good indication now that this is the second phase of deprecating third-party cookie support now, which has been met with a lot of debate in certain circles uh, in the browser, because although um, it limits cross-site tracking, I have found that um, with third-party cookies um, blocked, basically, in Chrome, it does cause a couple of problems on certain sites and so on. And you also are kind of forced on some sites to always log in if, if you have to log into a site and obviously when it removes and blocks those third-party cookies it means every time you go back to that site you've got to log in again so um, interesting to see where this is all going to end up but as mentioned by the end of this year 2024 unless something you know some regulator obviously opposes this um, you will all see these tracking protection settings uh, in your Google Chrome browsers if you are using Google Chrome. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.